Look how beautiful it is here. Hang on. It's October 9th or something, 8th, 7th, something like that. And it's so warm. There's people walking around in shorts. There's lots of fruit in this town. There's there's migrant workers working and there's, uh, there's stuff to do. A little bit of tourism. I'm at the desert center in the Soyuz today. And uh, man, is it beautiful. It's like 22 degrees. Normally this time of year you're wearing, you know, long underwear and rain gear and boots, and gloves and a toque. It's uh, spectacular weather. And what's amazing about this place, the Okanagan Valley, is if uh, you know, most Americans have no idea that we've got this kind of this kind of habitat here, rattlesnakes and scorpions and all that. It's incredible. This is called rabbit bush. Lots of people call it sage, but it's not sage. So don't be putting it in your turkey stuffing this year. It's gonna make you sick and it tastes horrible. It smells nice though. That's an asparagus fern growing there. How did it get there? Cool. I knew about the snakes and the scorpions, but there's a pygmy short horned lizard here. Wow. Wow. So cool. A greater sage grouse. A desert grouse. Standard desert rabbit. Desert night snake is so rare. They just found the first one in 97. Uh, longest snake is the gopher snake. They didn't say how long it is. Yellow-bellied racer, nice. Western rattler, Ooh. Anyway, what's the point? The point is, enjoy good weather. Don't worry about it, man. Your house isn't burning down today. Have a good time. Wear a t-shirt. Put some sunglasses on and walk around. Ambulate. And that concludes the Desert Center tour. It was wonderful. Must be a bumper crop of grapes this year. Oh, do they make good wine when the weather's so good though? Maybe they just make a bumper crop of totally bland, shitty wine. Maynard would know. Maybe more booze than food now with all the grapes though. It's funny, the Okanagan back in the 70s and 80s had uh, go-kart tracks and game farms and water slides and now it's just, it's all alcohol. It went from fun for kids to fun for the adults, yes. But uh, this is our own little paradise in BC. It is very special. So, I'm so happy to have spent most of my life in BC. It's just amazing, you know? It's got rivers and lakes and mountains and trees. And that and a sandwich and I'm pretty happy, you know? And that, that's, that's a, a big theme right now, is uh, keeping it simple and finding out what really matters, you know? So if you got people around you that are stressing you out and causing you a hard time, bumming you out for no good reason at all, you know? Uh, make some distance, get away from those people. Unless they're your kids, you're stuck with that, you gotta deal with those. There's just so much to be grateful for, you know, on this Thanksgiving weekend. So if you got your health, you got some good people, you're not starving, count yourself lucky. And if you don't feel any gratitude, I think I know what you should do. Come to the Greenwood Slag Heap and pick one of these up. Pick up one of these babies and bring it home. Just to remind yourself, you've had copper pipes and plumbing in your house your whole life. You can take a shit in your house. 
And that is a miracle. Okay, no more stops. I gotta get home. Have a good Thanksgiving weekend, you guys. Love you.